looking for stolen cars and the gangs who drive them. We've got a lot of vehicles that get stolen. We have a lot of burglaries. We've got quite a large gang culture. And all of these things bring with them the inherent use of vehicles by criminals. They all need to get around. So wherever you've got crime, you've got vehicles. Wherever you've got criminals who are using vehicles, you know, whether they be that they're wanted criminals or they've got something in the car that they don't want the police to find, they're going to put the foot to the floor and a pursuit's going to ensue. Criminals use vehicles on a daily basis and, you know, we're there to target them. It's quite, you know, we have a good success rate of pulling in stolen vehicles with recovery. About £800,000 worth of stolen vehicles a month. Expensive high performance motors are now the main target for Manchester's car thieves. Yeah, at the moment, mate, there's a Ferrari Spider 360 on the M56. It's a stolen, mate. The Ferrari reported stolen is worth more than 100,000. The good news is it has a satellite tracking system so police can follow its progress. So it's going towards Hale Barnes at the moment, mate. I think uh, Paul Grace just told me that, mate. I'll get back to you shortly. Just start making that area. The Ferrari is now heading towards PC's Talkington and Cross. There is a Ferrari just come that way, mate. Red one. Video on. Yeah, I mean, initial thoughts with the Ferrari, you think to yourself, this is a fast car, it, you know, it's a racing car. Sierra 9918, can they come in? If we get behind it and it does go for it, there's going to be uh, obviously a fast chase. Yeah, we're getting reports of a Ferrari from uh, Cheshire coming up the M56. We're currently behind one, Princess Parkway, city bound. We've not got a VRM yet, but it's uh, going to be one and the same, I would suggest. This might be an outstanding stolen uh, Ferrari. Yeah, he's coming as an outstanding stolen uh, 360 Indian Governor. Indian 999, mate. An outstanding stolen from uh, Wentworth Street, the city centre. Yeah, Sierra 9918. In that case, can we have uh, Indian 99? I'm not sure if they're grounded. And we also uh, require dog patrols and uh, traffic, please. Getting the force helicopter India 99 above them is now a priority. Show me his uh, ground commander. We're in the tactical phase. At the moment, it's a follow. The Ferrari can do more than 170 miles an hour, easily enough to see off the cops. But until support arrives, no attempt will be made to stop the thief. Two miles away in the city centre, PC still following the driver in the stolen Ferrari. That's a negative. I do not think they are it's aware. It uh, might be a female. Top a little bit, mate. Sierra 9918 CK, obviously there's no point in us lighting this up without any air support. What I suggest is that we try and get this vehicle stung at the earliest opportunity uh, and take it from there. The cops must wait until backup with a stinger arrives to take out the Ferrari's tyres. Have you got any joy with anyone trying to get ahead with a stinger, uh, CK? Well, 1983 Now another problem. An armed response vehicle is getting too close to the action. Can you ask the ARV to keep moving? Um, obviously, if they, uh, if they see her, they might just uh, spook it. We don't want this going at speed. CK might too. For your information there, CK, obviously in the tactical stage, we're not going to get out and try and uh, detain this driver until this vehicle is stung. We don't want this at any sort of speed through the city. We're straight across Sackville Street. CNI right 918, we've got uh, a right indication onto Richmond Street. That's Richmond Street off Sackville Street. Normally, when thieves know the cops are behind them, they put their foot down. But not this one. CNI 918, we're now uh, 10 mile an hour, vehicle Went pulling over go, Richmond mate. Street. It's pulling over street. Richmond Street of its own accord. Just wait. I think we're 9918, engine. 9918, engine off, standby. Police! Hiya. Just come over here. Is it your vehicle? When the vehicle pulled up and uh, the young lady got out in a dress and sunglasses, it was uh, somewhat unusual and certainly there was something slightly amiss. I'm just taking it back now. To where? To its owner. She wasn't your usual car thief, if you like. So initially I started thinking to myself, have we, is this vehicle stolen? Who, whose vehicle is it? My boyfriend. Is it? Right, OK. I'm bringing it back. It seems an innocent okay. explanation. I've got to tell you that you're under arrest. You've stolen the vehicle, haven't you? Yeah. That's all. 9918, van to this location, please, female adult arrest. But a lover's tiff is no defence, and the woman will still be taken in. The circumstances are that he has reported it stolen. 
So at the moment it's an outstanding stolen vehicle and obviously you're driving it. We'll have to go and lodge you at the police station and then we'll come and have a word with you. Yeah, no, we'll take her in, mate. She's going to have to be arrested, uh, as would any other person, until we can get to the bottom of the story. It may well be that he doesn't wish to make a complaint, but at this moment in time, his car's reported stolen. It's worth, I would suggest, in excess of 120000 Um So obviously she, she's going to have to account for why she's got it, why he's reported it stolen. It uh, would have been an interesting pursuit, but uh, thankfully it wasn't. So. And there's more good news. He doesn't want you prosecuted. Funnily enough. Um, He's going to, he wants us to take the car to Ferrari. I've said I'm not prepared to do that. I'll do it. The reason why she took it is now becoming clear. He knew for a fact I would never damage it or not look after it. So he's got enough money, he can do anything, he can pay for whatever, you know, solicitors and stuff. So I was never going to win that way. So it was a case of what can I do to hurt him like I've been hurt? But it's the cops who are caught in the middle. It seemed that the police on this occasion were used as a tool by one of the parties involved in this domestic simply to get the vehicle back. Um, very, very frustrating and a, a huge waste of police time and resources.